Hey guys, Carl Cooper here with OnTheBlack.com. So as many of you know, um, I really want the Mets to trade for Adam Dunn. So, you know, I'm making a case here in this video post uh, that the Mets uh, should trade for Dunn. Um, in the slide coming up, I'm going to compare Dunn to what I would consider sort of his competition right now on the Mets. So let's take a look. Let me know what you guys think. So in comparing Dunn's stats as of last Monday evening to Sheffield Murphy and Mark Tian, I put Tian on this list because there's been talks about the Mets possibly trading for him. Uh, Sheffield has the highest average. Uh, right now, Tian leads in at-bats and in hits. But the, the reason why I want Dunn is look at the next few next two columns here. Home runs with 19 and RBIs with 53. He's blowing away what I would consider his competition uh, in those two categories. And then the last two columns, obviously, uh, most of you have complained that the reason why you don't, don't want Dunn is because of the strikeouts and the errors. But, you know, in looking at the home runs and the RBIs, that's the main reason why I want Dunn. And to me, this outweighs the uh, strikeouts and his errors. Now, one thing I want to do point out is that obviously with all the injuries that the Mets have right now, one player is not going to make a difference in this team, no matter who it is. But at the same time, you know, adding Adam Dunn in the middle of that lineup, whether he bats four or five, you know, stretches out uh, a lineup that is pretty weak right now. And, you know, it, it starts the, the trend of bringing in players or, or adding someone to this team that could help turn it around. Again, not one player is going to turn it around. The team that we have right now on the field has to play better. Um, if they bring in somebody, they have to contribute, so on and so forth. But, you know, there is a glaring need on this team for some power in the middle of that lineup, for opposing pitchers to be afraid of someone in the middle of that lineup, and that just isn't there right now. And I think that that's a good start uh, for the Mets um, to trade for someone like Dunn to help start to turn this thing around a little bit and to kind of hold hold things together until, you know, Beltran comes back, until Reyes comes back, and maybe even Delgado, who knows if he's coming back or not, but until they come back. So those that's the real reason why I want Adam Dunn. He can, uh, you know, hit the long ball. You can put him in the middle of the lineup. He stretches out the lineup, and he also puts fear in opposing pitchers. So uh, that's it on my Dunn analysis. Uh, let me know what you guys think. Talk to you soon.